What's up everybody? I am back with another plan with me. Um, uh, last week we, I ended up not planning at all just because I was in New York from Monday to Thursday and then we had a pretty busy weekend because Sunday was our first wedding anniversary. So you can see all the things that we did on, um, this past, all the things that I saw in New York and, and also all the things that we did this past weekend over on our new vlog channel. So my husband and I have started vlogging, which I'm super excited about because um, those are some of the, my favorite videos for myself to watch back. Um, so I definitely love, I love that we're vlogging even though we get like Two views so if you want to go and be a supporter and subscribe that would be amazing <laughs> um, I'll leave a link down below and you can check out our vlogs and um, I do quite a bit of um, actually even this weekend I do a couple scrapbook store hauls and things like that so whenever I go shopping you know I don't I don't do a lot of hauls or anything like that on this video on this channel um, but I feel like in a vlog it's more natural and just I'm showing you what I got. So I got did get a few things um, like some stamps for to make some cards this year for the holidays. So I'm pretty excited about that. Um, so for this week, August 15th to the, through the 21st, excuse my nails, they are um, pretty bad. So don't ignore those. <laughs> But they kind of actually almost match the little sandy color. But I'm going to use the Caress Press Sandals Kit. And this is my first time using a Caress Press Kit. And I think if you feel the quality of their stickers, it feels like vinyl, which I think it is. I think it is vinyl. So it's a super thick sticker. So I don't know if you would use this every single time you plan because your planner would then get super thick, but um, it is really nice. Um, I like this, This here's the functional kit, here are the full boxes, the um, date headers, which I've never used before, so I'm excited to use those. Some half boxes, um, some checklists, here's the um, headers. And I like that they're different colors, so that should be interesting when I use those. Um, so these are washi pieces and then some deco, um, the heart checklists, boxes, and then here's the bottom washi and then sidebar um, checklists as well. So I'm filming this a little late just because, you know, last week was just absolutely crazy, but what can you do? It's going up, right? <laughs> So, um, yeah, but I was telling you about, we have this new vlog, which I'm super excited about. It's just, um, you know, at first I was like, oh, I don't know. I really like vlogging. Like I like the, one of the, my favorite videos on my channel right now is the fact that we have our proposal for, from when Ryan proposed to me on this um, channel and you know that's the one that I really like to go back and watch um, so that one I think I think that's kind of what spurred it I was just looking back at some of my videos and thinking gosh I really wish I had um, more of those vlogs and all the things that we've done together on our first year of marriage. So now that school is basically almost coming to an end, um, I'm almost done. This week is actually my last week of the two classes um, that I'm taking right now. This is the last time that I will be taking two classes at a time. So I am pretty thrilled about that. Um, so I'm after this, I get a week break from school. And then I have one class for eight weeks instead of two because I'm pretty much done. And then after that, I have my final class and then um, also a portfolio review. And then I will be 100% done, like all the way done with school. 
so I am pretty thrilled about that. I'm just imagining all the extra time I'll have. So, um, with that, I, um, I've joined a gym, I've done things like, um, we started vlogging, so I thought maybe, gosh, I don't know if we want to do daily vlogging, I don't know if I have time for that, but it's actually kind of a relaxing thing that I do before bed, because Ryan goes to bed super early, he, like, he gets up really early as well, too, though, so kudos to him for that, but at the same time, I don't get up that early, I'm more of a night owl, I get all my homework and stuff done late at night, um, so that's, that's what I like to do. So vlogging is kind of, it, I don't do anything super fancy, I don't know if you've seen some of those other vloggers out there like the Michelax, they have an amazing vlog and if you've not seen it you need to go check them out. They have a beautiful blog, but, um, and they only do it once a week though. So, I mean, there's that too, but the things that I really love is I just want to capture the moments. That's the whole point of the reason why we want to vlog. Kind of, you know, the same reason why I, um, like to scrapbook. I like to capture the moment. So, you know, and same thing with these planners. I mean, really, it's not, um, it's, the reason I decorate is because I like to keep my planners. I have planners from way back in the day that I used to use, um, but actually, planners back in the day for me were moleskins. And, um, I used to love to doodle and everything like that, so, um, I just, I'm still in love with using these. So I think I'm gonna, just a real quick showing what I'm doing today. The, since these kind of go in alternating four different colors, I think I wanna go this light color at the top and then switch the other way and go these, just so there's a little bit of contrast. I don't know, I'm trying to think. Is that what I wanna do? Or keep the colors together? It might flow a little bit better, better, almost like a wave, if you think about it. Oh, that would have been cool if I would have done this here, this here. Oh, man. Maybe I'll do that. I don't know. Let me think about it for a second. So, I'm back. I think I'm going to do the little things next, but I am going to do uh, mixing up the colors a bit. Just to give it a little bit more life, I think. Um, also because I want to use more of these, um, more of the teal color, which on the top, I only got to use one, so it's my secret little trick to use more of the color. Um, but yeah. How are y'all? Hoping everything's great. Um, I had somebody tweet me asking me if I was going to keep doing planner videos and I was like, well, I don't know. Um, you know, with the, with the daily vlogging, that's, that's a lot of making of the videos and editing, but, um, you know, with full-time job and full-time school, but at the same time, it's kind of, it's, it's not, even, not kind of, it is what I love doing so and I love sharing what I'm doing with all of you guys so I definitely want to keep doing these especially since somebody tweeted me the other day and was like are you gonna still do those and I was like well do you still watch them and I said yeah I just got really into them and um, so they were pretty excited about it and I was like well I've got one fan, so this is for you, one fan that tweeted me. <laughs> so, here you go. Um, so, this week, for my little things, let's do things that I always forget to do first, um, that I always want to do first, are the meals. Let's do meals first. And I'll try to put these all the same color, but I don't know how well that's going to work out. I'll probably end up not being able to do 
all the same color for the little things, but we shall try. Um, so right now I'm just putting down the meals for planning dinners, um, getting back into the swing of things. Now that I'm back last week, I felt almost like I didn't know what was going on with my life because I don't know, just going on business trips always seems to throw me off a little bit. Um, especially with food so I came back and there's no food <laughs> to eat um, everything's kind of going out of date because um, I've been gone and my husband doesn't he's not the greatest cook so if you've seen some of our vlogs he, you'll see he did a um, taco chats with um, and just you just listen to him and he's hilarious so yeah um, and then I think I have tomorrow a package coming so oh see I knew it was gonna happen I have to use a different color so because this one's an alarm whereas the package is like over here so let's see um, let's use the same color as the top. So let's use this one. Then next, I've got a TV show and a package coming from Amazon. I've got another package from Amazon too. Um, but I think that's not going to come until next week. So let's see. Monday, I need to do... Laundry. Oh, we're mixing up the colors already. That's all right. Um, definitely need to do some laundry. And then um, at the end of the week, there's only one film, um, but that's okay. I need to get ahead of the game and film my plan with me for you guys. Um, on Fridays like I used to do and get them up so that they will be live on uh, Sundays so I want to try and do that so let's also for Sunday let's put on here mm, maybe one of these asterisks I think and put um, a little thing that says something about being the last day of school. Yay! So happy about that. Um, I love school. Don't get me wrong, but I'm ready for a break. So, yeah. Um, let's see. Do I need anything else on here? Um, ooh, maybe these dates or I could do... Yeah, let's do these two little heart date things for Tuesday, Thursday. Um, Tuesday, Thursday, I have my gym class I just joined. Um, it's it's similar to, I last year I did something, basically it's the same thing, um, except it's a, a smaller company. Um, but I joined another one, it's actually closer to where I live, so um, it's this new thing called Orange Theory, which I think um, to get myself to be more active, I have to have it set up as like an appointment. I can't just have it, um, I can't just have it like set up for, um, oh yeah, I'll go at this time or, or this day. I just don't know what time, that kind of thing. I have to set it up as an appointment. So those classes where you have to sign up in advance and say, oh, hey, the class is at this time. I'm going to show up at this time. Those really do the best for me. So um, also, ooh, I wanted to sign up for a um, scrapbook class. There's a pink ink stamping class that I think I want to go to at a local scrapbook store. Which one should I use? Um, I know it's Saturday. 
I think I shall use this little, maybe this little alarm, since it's the same color too. <laughs> and then that will be for that day. Um, what else? Um, I think for now, I know I'm going to use this paw someday um, for, I'm going to take our dogs to the groomer. So if you watch our vlogs on our anniversary yesterday, because um, I'm filming this on Monday, um, on our anniversary was yesterday on the 14th, we took the dogs up to Rampart Reservoir. It's a lake here in Colorado Springs and we um, let the dogs run around and stuff but it's they love Dakota loves to actually get into the water so she's she's a little dirty so we're gonna get take her to the groomers I've got to set it up an appointment but the place that we're the place that I take her does not um, they don't, they're not open on Mondays, so, because they're open on Saturdays, so their weekend is like Sunday, Monday, so, gotta wait till tomorrow to schedule it, so I don't exactly know when. I think, though, if it, if I call tomorrow, I'm probably gonna wanna do it on Wednesday. Um, yeah. So, yeah, let's put on these date covers. This is the first time I'm using the date covers, so... Um, I know this was something that I definitely wanted to try out. Um, I just like the extra added look and feel of those, um, day covers. I think they just bring it all together. But with these neutral, the neutral planners, I mean, it really, the black text and no colors behind it really just goes with everything so um, that's a, one of the reasons why I picked the neutral Erin Condren um, so yeah I think I really like them I, you have to write in the number date though so I'll have to go back and do that cute Oh, I already see one thing though. It does cover up that corner piece. So we'll have to use like a um a deco or something to kind of add some little bit of make it look like it wasn't meant to do that or something. <laughs> um let's see. Let's add the full boxes. Um let's see here. Let's put this one. Oh, I should put the today if I'm gonna be done with those. Yeah, so. Um, how many of you guys actually like to watch vlogs? I know those lately have been my favorite things to watch. Um, our family vloggers and just watching people's lives. It's like my version of reality TV Because um, I'm not the biggest fan of reality TV. I could I Watched the bachelorette, but really what I do is I watch like the first 10 minutes and then I get bored And then I fast forward to the end just so I can know who got voted off. So <laughs> It's literally like a 15 minute show that I watch for the bachelorette. I don't know. I'm just not I don't know. I'm not, I'm not a big fan. I think I'm just going to go ahead and plan. Now that I'm thinking about it, go ahead and plan to have the dogs go to the groomer on Wednesday. Yeah, let's just do that. I'll call tomorrow, plan for Wednesday. If it doesn't work out, I'll just write a note in here. But, yeah. So... Some of my favorite vloggers lately have been, like I mentioned earlier, um, the Michelacs. They were a British family. They, they kind of remind me of me and my husband. So 
It's one of the reasons why I like them. And then I also love Ciccone Jolie's, and you'll notice a trend. I love British and Irish YouTubers just because um, those, are, those are the places that I really love to visit, and I really just like to follow them. The other ones, I really like the Shea Tarts. Um, they're a fun family, also similar to what I feel like. Ryan and I would be like when we start having more kids, obviously, but we don't have any children right now. Um, but yeah, those ones are my favorites. And I watch a little bit of like, um, what's her name? Bits and Clips. She's really cute too. I really like hers. Um, let's do this one. Okay, and then maybe a, do I want to do that one? No, because I want this one to be on the other page, because I think I'm going to use this one here. All right, oh, the dilemma of figuring out where you want to put your stickers. Trying to mix up the colors a little bit. Um, yeah, let's do this one on Friday. Oh, I think I made the top might something might be a slightly crooked, so the rest are now suffering. Oh, stickers! So that one's a little bit straight, but you can see. Oh well. Um, oh, and then I put teal next to a teal, huh? Well, let's put this here, actually. Let me put that one on Saturday. Oopsie. It's a little crooked. There's a little sliver of white. Oh, I'm over it. <laughs> It'll help straighten it out for the bottom. So that's cute. Love it. Love it. Okay. And then... On the side over here, I'll want to do, she has some extra ones, like, to clean, and then errands, maybe? Yeah, let's do those two, to clean and errands, and let's do this one on the bottom. Okay, and let's do this one next. Lovely. Some, I'll want to do my currently. So let's do a half box. Oh, let's do this checkbox one. And then I'll want to have something probably on, on the outside of it. Um, probably this one. Let's do these. Does that work? Yeah, that works perfectly. Okay, so putting a little piece of washi tape down. And then the top washi will have to be this thicker one. Oh, I'm gonna have to flip so I can see what I am doing. These stickers are so like 
high quality. But at the same time, this type of sticker is actually pretty easy to lift up. So they're not too bad in that aspect. Um, let's do a habit tracker. Right there. And then I think what I do, what works best for me on the habit tracker thing is um, the just being active. So I'm going to have to cut off a little sliver because I like to be able to see the G that goes down. So, And oops, the way I do that is I just um, I need to get right there. Okay. Take a pair of scissors if you don't have an X-Acto knife lying right next to you, which I couldn't be bothered with searching for it. So like that, done with this one, can throw that one away. So I don't know that you can recycle this. This seems like paper that you wouldn't be able to recycle. So my guess is just throw it away. Um, so there, and then, ooh, my corner. Wonder what color, probably blue would be best to accent my little August day. Cute. I feel like I'm losing track of what I was talking about, but um There, a little bit of an accent, you can see. Just gives it a little bit of color. Since it's the neutral, um, kind of adds and then you can customize it. I really like that this yellow pretty much um, almost exactly matches the sand color. So that's kind of nice, almost exactly. <laughs> so on here, let's do a, to clean, because it feels like um, I've got a lot to clean, but it's usually what happens when I leave on a business trip for a few days. It feels like nothing was done. Oh my goodness. You can't leave Ryan alone. It's like the world ends. <laughs> he goes back to his original state from before we were married and doesn't do anything. Oh, Ryan, if you're listening, if you watch this read the comments somebody say something about it he needs to get his act together so um i think what i'm gonna do here on the bottom i want to use this washi tape but i want to use how much do i need for a half box three of these i like the starfish design right here at the bottom that kind of melds well with the bottom piece so all oh, this tiny sliver of washi tape though I feel like is pointless I wish it wasn't that small tiny pieces <laughs> you have to have like tweezers to do this Oh, have any of you ever seen those tiny paper crafting um, models that I've seen a bunch of them in um, videos from like people that are in Japan? You can order them on online, which I've ordered a couple before, um, just to test out, and I've made super cute tiny building stuff from Studio Ghibli films. So if you love Studio Ghibli, you should definitely track those down and try them out if you enjoy those types of things. Um, but it's just super tiny paper. You have to use um, 
you have to use the tweezers and stuff to do most of it because it's just so tiny. I'm using this teensy tiny washi up because I don't know when else I would ever use that. Um, just doing a little bit on the bottom so it's not completely all the way at the bottom. And then I think I'll use this lighter glitter. And these ones I usually just put like random stuff for the day or any reminders during the the week that I need to write down. Um, I don't usually um, do more than that. These videos are super long, so let me know if you like the, the really long ones because I know sometimes I definitely do. I like to just put these kinds of things on in the background and while I'm working or something and just glance up at it or something. It's kind of like I have to have something on while I'm working so that I don't go crazy. <laughs> Um, I'm going to use this one there, yeah. Just, just to have that noise, but also I like to, that's usually when I watch things like, um, planner videos when they're super long like this, so I just sit and listen to someone chatting, <laughs> and then, um, glance up and look at and see, like, oh, that's cute, or... Just glancing up to see what, what the planner looks like so far. I'd really like the chatty ones. I know, especially with process videos with um, for scrapbooking, process videos are definitely um, very nice to listen to somebody chat, which usually pro those videos take much longer time. Um, so you're... Um, the person is, is talking and then the, their hands are moving at full speed. So I've, I've done a couple of those videos in the past. If you, um, scroll through some of my previous, um, previous videos and process videos and things. So, um, but it's really, it's best if you have somebody that um, does that and they are like a really soft talker. Like I feel like those people is just super beautiful, just not beautiful. What, do you, what am I talking about? I don't know, but it's like almost lulls you to sleep. <laughs> Not in a bad way, but it's kind of just relaxing and enjoyable. I like to do those. Um, like if I film a process video, I'll put process videos on in the background. Nerd alert, I know. Um, but <laughs> put something like that on in the background while I'm filming a process video. Because you speed up your video for those. Cause it's, or else it's just really... Um, really long so yeah I definitely need the extra piece of washi right there for those let's do the bottom there we go so if you like the long videos give this a thumbs up because I would like to know if you like these to be um, longer. I think I'm gonna just write these in with this pen. It's my um, Pilot Juice Pen. I order these on Amazon um, and I have a bunch of them. I love these. I had like a, a whole set of all the different colors and I loved how well this wrote. Um, so I just, it glides really easy, doesn't like skip or anything like that, which some pens can do. It stays on, 
doesn't it doesn't smudge at all see um, especially on glossy or anything like that so that's what I enjoy about it um, let's add some deco these are so cute look at those sunglasses those are adorable the little summer dress skirt and the hat those are cute um, I think what I want to use I know I wanted to do something over here in the corner, something small that will fit. Um, probably this little pink one, maybe. Pink starfish, just to kind of make it look like it's not quite as disconnected. Um, and then I'll put some other deco around the top. Let's put this guy. I love the little sunglasses, those are so cute. The little sun hat. Um, let's put that down here. And oh, I can't forget my weekend banner. I always forget these sometimes. Should I put it down here or up here? Probably let's do down here this time. And cut off a little bit of the today rather than kind of hide a little bit of those gaps that I made. Um, <clears throat> Oh, I have a dentist appointment on Monday. I've got that one. I let's see. Um, for me, I guess I can use this one too. Payday is this day, but it actually goes through earlier because I do direct deposit. Direct deposit always seems to go through earlier um, let's do but first coffee um, a little reminder just as it's cute should we put it there or somewhere else no it's down <laughs> um movie night let's do a movie night this week um how about friday i'd love to go see a movie let's go see something and then, oh, let's use this little planner. So that will go with the filming. And I'll put that, it's gonna cover up today a little bit, but that's okay. And I'm gonna put plan with me. There, just to remind myself to film that on Friday. And then next week I'm actually gonna use um, the last Scribble Prints Co. mystery kit that I got. I just wanted to test it out. Um, and it's it's super cute. I So I, I usually like to just buy these one-off ones that are on sale, so like summer's almost over, so I wanted to kind of enjoy a summer kit before it's all over. Um, let's see, what else do I have left? I've got these. I need to, um, let's, I need to do my nails. So let's do that. Um, probably, not tonight, maybe tomorrow after the gym. I'll put that there to do nails. Because obviously I need it. <laughs> And then, let's say, y'all, this little workout thing, put that right here, and there's a kettleball or a scale. I don't weigh myself. I think, especially if you're, you know, getting back into the groove of working out, weighing yourself Especially if you're doing strength training too. Weighing yourself is not going to give you a real number. It's going to give you um, something that will probably discourage you, which you know it really shouldn't, but it 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 does. It's the reality of it. <clears throat> um, but let's see. I put this for trash day. Um, yeah, but weighing yourself, because when you gain muscle, it weighs more than 
fact. So if you're not seeing the scale go down, but I feel like just like the short amount of time that I've been um, going to this new gym and going, we've been doing a lot more. Now that we're doing daily vlogs, I feel like, you know, you want to do more during the day and not just sit at home and be stuck in a funk, which I feel like sometimes I get there. Um, you know, and that's, I think it's really difficult to get out of something like that. So, yeah, it's, <clears throat> um, but yeah, weighing yourself when you're just starting, don't do it. It's just, just keep plugging along. Maybe weigh yourself like once a month, I feel like. So I feel like sometimes it can discourage you, but also it can motivate you when you see something amazing. Um, this is just gonna be a little piece of deco over there. It's a little cleaning. These little clean things. Um, and then for currently, I think I may just um, cover up this top one. It has a little smudge on it, so that might be even a good idea. Cover up the smudge. For my currently, um, I, here I put what I'm currently reading, and I'll probably put my my current favorites. I guess I could even use this little heart sticker. I'm trying to use up some of these stickers that usually I have a bunch of these little things left over. For these ones, I will probably use them in my um, work journal. I know I, I've, I haven't really shown you this before, but started do it using this one for work because I just needed somewhere to list out some things like here are my three priorities for the day so I might even just use those in here so it'll be a little extra cute for me when I'm listing out my priorities for the day um, each week when the day starts let's see y'all um, I don't ever use these bill do things because um, I'm a big believer in automatic payments, <laughs> so just set it and forget it. Not really forget it, because you're going to remember that you got to pay something, but here's the little freebie. I don't know that I'm going to use it just because the colors don't match. Um, again, same thing. I'll probably use this in there as well. And I don't think I'm going to use any of these other ones. Let's see. Probably not. I'll save those for my other planners. Same with these. I think I'll save those for that. Um, same with these. I'll just set these ones aside. And some extra washi too as well. And I think I won't save those too because I know I'll never use them. But I'll save these too. And then that is it. I hope you enjoyed. I think this one turned out really, it feels calming. So even though I'm not at the beach, it is almost like, hey, my planner went to the beach this week. Um, so I'm just going to continue putting a couple pieces of, um, of this deco up at the top and just give it a little bit more flair up there. But that is about it for today so if you are new to my channel please subscribe and welcome super excited to have you here and then um you know if there's something that you want to see maybe a certain if you have an etsy shop that you have some super cute stickers that you want me to check out um, i'd love to see them i always love to peruse the Etsy sticker shops. There's always seems like there's someone new out there that's coming up with new ideas and new designs. So that's always 
it's always fun to try someone new, which um, I feel like I enjoy doing. Um, just testing out new new sticker sets and things like that. So leave your Etsy shop if you have an Etsy shop or leave your planner process videos if you do those as well. And or even your Instagram if that's all you do. I know a lot of people don't do the videos. Um, they just they just plan and sometimes take pictures on their Instagram. Leave that information on the bottom. I'd love to check it out. And again, thanks for watching. Bye.